and we're back. Um, I paused that so none of that went over the air. When last we left, we decided that the vanishing point would be up here. That's the viewpoint of the um, viewer. Yeah, the viewpoint of the viewer. Because I figured Dino's head would be down around this level. So the viewer's viewpoint would be just above eye level. All right. And you'll see in a minute why that becomes necessary. Let me connect those corners. I'll do a slight line here for the file cabinet show the perspective. Do that later. Now, the desk level is about there usually. The floor level would be... <coughs> sneeze. sneeze. And uh, let's see, since we we're looking up high, You'll see quite a bit of the desk. Now, Bo's chair, we'll put around there. And there's Bo's butt, knee, leg, knee, leg, torso, head. I'll be looking off in that direction. My hemisphere, the oval. And remember the uniforms have these high collars, have these military lapels. And four pockets, not necessary to draw at the moment. Let's see, you'll have elbow, hand on knee, and the other hand, eh, say sitting on the, on the desk as if he's just turned to look toward the sound. Boots. Now, ironically, I think I made him a little bit too tall. Yeah, yeah, he's a little bit too tall because uh, if I draw where Dino's head's going to be. He's going to be shorter to a, than a sitting bow. Ow. <clears throat> Let me, um... We draw Dino first, then. Actually, he's now drawing his head too large, I think. Oh, getting the scale right. It's just what looks right. All right. Knees, feet. Okay, so Bo's head can't be taller than Dino's because he's sitting. I'm going to make it smaller, too, as he is sort of in the background more. Let's try that again. And that will probably work. Looks about right. And let's put Mia in here behind Dino. They're about the same height. Mia's based on um, Marcy from the Peanuts comic strip. But she's also named after a woman. I actually knew Mia Park. K Korean drummer. And actually we don't have to draw very much about Mia. We just got her hips, her breast, and the rest of her is off, off panel. Okay. Now to add the drama, in the third panel we get a close-up of the cat boss as he's giving the orders. Oh, uniform henchmen are ordered to sacrifice their lives in a futile defense of the lair. So, uh, a bit more of a close-up. 
but not that much that I do want to do a lot. I'll have him... Hmm. Futile. Yeah, he should be looking down with this. He's going to be caressing the megaphone, as he says. Futile defense. Sort of. Okay. Square cat nose. Darth Vader. Evil eyes. Shirt, tie, and once again the megaphone, which later on we'll look up to see what a megaphone looks like. But he'll be having this hand sort of caressing it. And the other hand is underneath the frame here, so you won't see it. And lapel of the jacket. And that's about all we gotta do. The rest is done cleanup. Now, the, the payoff, the punchline. Gotta have all three characters, maybe even, yeah, yeah, we'll have the cat boss coming, standing here, witnessing. All three characters standing there naked. Oh, in their underwear. Out of uniform, as it were. Now, will it, they still be at the, the cubicle? Because this takes up a lot of space. What I think I'll do is I've got to fit all three characters in here. So, there's Mia, there's Dino. And there's Bo, still sitting, still seated. And the cat, boss, enter. Somewhere down there. All right. Now let's, let's lay out these forms. Um, I'm thinking they should be like looking up and whistling. Dino you know, will be smoking a cigarette and that sort of thing. Uh, Yes, it's politically incorrect, or Dino, or socially incorrect, for Dino to be a smoker, but he's not supposed to be a role model for anyone. Us, us role models are hard to come by, you know. What can I say? Ah, old habits die hard. I'm drawing him in a uniform. And look, I drew his pants. Guess he'll just be in socks. And since Bo's sitting down, he can afford a pair of boxer shorts. Very thin arms, tiny man boobs, bit of a gut. And here's Now, Dino's going to be in the most unflattering, tidy whities possible.
bit of a gut over them all. Uh, let's see, Mia's got slightly larger hips, a woman, breast line, she'll keep her legs together, poised, perfect posture as it were. Um, probably ankle high, I mean knee high stockings, yeah, makes sense. Uh, bra of the least flattering quality. And I wonder if she'll give up the gun. <laughs> oh, I have the gun laying on the floor over here. Mia's always the only one with a gun. The gun's dropped on the floor underneath the signature. Big, wide, elastic waistband. And fluffy underwear. Okay, let's get the cat boss looking up kind of in his normal patois Bad boss. Hands down, little fists. Tie. Suit jacket. He won't be riding the Roomba vacuum cleaner today, I don't think. Not really necessary. And we'll just do this outside the cubicles because Bo's chair shouldn't be too far away from the cubicle. And about right there makes sense. Oh, forgot to draw the chair. Bo's just sort of sitting in midair. Uh, no. Okay. Did you get the I headphone? Heard. You got the headphones on again? I thought I heard my wife. No. I said I forgot to draw the chair. Oh. Yeah, that sounds exactly like my wife. Yeah. <laughs> she has quite a chair, isn't she, folks? Let's see. Okay, all the horizontal lines are done. And that is how pencil, a rough pencil, a comic strip. Uh, maybe later on you can see the finish inking, uh, the finish penciling. Goodbye, folks.